What's up? What's up? Your boy Trap Boy Fuse. You already know what it is. Let me move this up a little bit. Yeah. What it is, y'all already know. What it is, y'all already know what it is, man. Your boy Trap. Yeah. Let's talk about it. The focus right. Let's put it back. The IAI 20. Let's talk about it. It's a nice interface. It's a nice interface, you know what I mean? But uh, let me tell you something. It's a, hold on, third generation, 18 in, 20 out, US, USB audio audio interface. Okay, 24 bit, 190, two hertz. Yeah, that's what they say, huh? Okay, now. Let's get to these ports on this focus right. I820. Now, on the back, as you can see, we got ports. Right? Everybody should know how it look. That's a nice looking interface. Call this nice little red bitch. Red lip bitch. But uh, you know, look real nice. Now, what we got a problem here with this thing is. The problem is with this interface is the lines in. Let me catch y'all. The line in, you know, the lines in that's on this thing is ridiculous. It's ridiculous on this thing, man. All right, you got eight. You got no. You got eight lines that's supposed to be right. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But you really only got damn hmm, four ports, right? Four, your four lines. You got three, four, five, six, right? Then you got seven, eight, nine, ten. But it's so confusing on this. Why do they got eight and ten, right? I check this out. They got eight, they got ten, right? But you could only use. Man, listen, they got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight lines. The first two lines you can't even use. Maybe you got a drum. You could connect a drum. You connect uh, what else that is? Microphones. You know what I'm saying? In the front two are instruments. Okay, boom. All right. Then you got three, four. Five, six. Okay, you could use them for like outboard gear, you know what I'm saying? Your gear, whatever. Four splots. Now, seven and eight, you can't use it. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it ain't right. But you can't use the shit. If you stick anything in. Now, hold on. Before we even get to that. Now, tell me why one and two. Is for speakers. Right? What is 9 and 10 is for? Now, why ain't that for the speakers? So, do I say what it is? One and two in the front, you might well could use them for just speakers, for some for some for some headphones, two headphones, or whatever you got going on. Boom. Then, so the other line that you can use. The, okay, you use one or two for speakers, for headphones, not headphones, but for microphones or whatever you got going on. You know what I'm saying? But in the back end and the out outlet for one and two, they use it for speakers. And you can't change it. Then what I thought when I seen it, I said, damn, okay, they got nine and ten. That must be for the speakers. Left and right. But it's not. No matter what you do, you cannot change that. Focus right. You need to get up, hit me up. Find out what's going on. Change the software where you could be able to change that. But you can't. It retarded. You can't do it. Now they got uh the op uh, the ADAT. Them shits don't work. They probably do work, man. I don't know, man. This is confu it's a confusing interface. You sell a lot of reviews on there. They're getting paid for it, they don't ship it out to them. 
they talking so highly of this 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 thing, but it's really it's a good interface. Don't get me wrong. You know what I'm saying? It sounds great, but they analog. If you want to run analog on this, and what you're getting it for, you're gonna be very sad if you got eight pieces of gear and you want to hit all eight up to this. You cannot do that. They designed this only for four. They got it inside the hardware, something like that. The monitoring is, the software is confusing as hell. You know what I'm saying? You will think they've been doing this for three generations. This is the third generation. They still don't got that software right. They need to get with a software developer, pay some money, they get it right. You know what I'm saying? And try to figure out on what's going on. Then you got this. Hold up. Confusing. I just it's just confusing. You know what I'm saying? It's a if you once you get it, you can actually plug and play with it. That's a good thing about this interface. It's plug and play. You know what I'm saying? But the one thing is when you plug in the plan, you be like, okay, yeah, it's it's great. But then when you go into that software and trying to figure out like why is the speakers connected to one and two? Why they got a number nine and ten? What's that for? You know what I'm saying? Why number ten? You be like, what connect by there? Nothing. Unless it's somewhere I went through everywhere looking for trying to figure it out, but you can't find nothing. You know what I'm saying? So they got to figure this out. You know what I'm saying? Focus right, y'all need to figure it out. Do I got to go spend three thousand dollars on a red line just to get all my IOs? You know what I'm saying? I'm kind of, I want to get that, but guess what? I might be, I might get messed up like this. You know what I'm saying? This is, is a is a complete disaster with the software and the IOs and what's going on with it. So beware of the IOs and what's going on with this interface. You know what I'm saying? The only reason I'll be getting another interface is because of that. I got it for eight ins and outs. They don't give you eight ins and outs. Two of the lines, one and two, is for the speakers. Nine and ten, supposed to be for speakers. I don't know. Then another thing that I ran through. Certain XLR, what is it? XLR balance cables would make this work too, or also work. Running from my patch bay. The Amazon ones that come from Amazon, I'm going to drop a link in the description just for that for y'all in case you want to get this and you want to make sure that it worked. You know what I'm saying? Because not even, damn, not even the Megummies will even pull up on you. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm I was confused with that there. Like, it might be something wrong with this interface, but like the XLRs, when it's my patch bay only the cheap Amazon for the nine dollars will work in this interface. You know what I'm saying? The type here. You know what I'm saying? Cheap ones. Cost nine dollars. They'll work. But gummies will not work. You know what I'm saying? I tried everything. I was trying to figure out why. I ordered some um some high-end um, snakes. From um, Sweetwater, from my boy Matt down at Sweetwater, Matt South, or something like that. I think it's his name, Matt South. But um, yeah, I ordered it, and guess what? The XLR would not work in here. I thought I had everything color coded. It's like one, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm slapping everything in. I get down there, and I'm trying to figure out why it ain't working. You know, that's a problem with this interface. Every XLR. Whatever it is, uh, balance quarter inch would not fit in here. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of crazy. I was trying to shake my head, trying to figure it out. You know what I'm saying? But it's a confusing interface. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I'm gonna get a carbon or something and try that. You know, stay tuned for that. That's coming. So focus right. You don't lost me on that one now. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got to figure out. How to get one and two. I don't know why I said one and two main. That was stupid, bro. Like, man, it made no sense. So, y'all got to figure out on how to get y'all software and get this stuff working. Y'all need to get nine and ten to work how it's supposed to work. You know what I'm saying? And why seven and eight is connected to the headphone. Seven and eight is the headphone. 
You know what I'm saying? I'm confused on that. Why 78 is connected to the headphone jacks? You know what I'm saying? If you stick somebody up, there's a bunch of fuckery going on with this interface. For $550, let me tell you something. I don't know what kind of reviews they giving and saying it's all that. Yeah, it sound good. You know what I'm saying? Sound good. You know, I, had, I thought I thought it was messed up on my how I was riding it in Pro Tools and I heard a lot of noise. So I'm like, man, it got a lot of motherfucking noise. You know what I'm saying? Now I figured out it's the way I was riding this out the Pro Tools. Everything sound good. But I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces of gear. And I want to hook them up on their own IOs. And I can't. So I got to run, no, let me, seven, eight. I got eight different, I, mean, I got two EQs, a whole bunch of compressors. I'm trying to hook up and run through it. You cannot do that. You feel me? So, bunch of bullshit. You know what I'm saying? So, I want eight ins and outs. Did what I bought it for. Did what I wanted. This thing say 18 ins. 18 ins. 20 outs. Shit. A bunch of bullshit. Let me see What's that, 18 ends? One, two, three, that's, that's eight. Why the hell 18 ends? How the fuck get 18 ends? What the fuck they get at? Bunch of bullshit, like I said. Why would they say that? You know what I'm saying? What well, they really ain't. But somebody who got a band or something, it probably might work for them. It don't work for me. Bunch of bullshit. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah, Scarlet, I eight, I-20, my... A little quick little review just talking about it, my little problems, and that whatever about the about the routing and the goddamn IOs on this thing. You know, the ins and outs on this thing is not what they saying advertised it to be. You know what I'm saying? It's four. This is a four ins and outs on this thing. You know what I'm saying? It's four channels, not eight channels, four channels on this thing. Beware of that when you're buying this. It's a bunch of bullshit. Focus right, hit me up. Let me know what's up. Y'all probably can figure it out and I'll take the video down. You know what I'm saying? And we can figure it out. Senior engineer to me so we can talk about this and we can go through it. And we can figure this, figure this out for the next fourth generation. I don't know how this been out. It's been out probably two years, three years. For the fourth generation that's supposed to be coming out. You know what I'm saying? And I want y'all to come out the fourth generation and be right. You know what I'm saying? You got Universal Audio on y'all ass right now with them folk, them little cheap ass motherfucking interfaces coming out. Y'all better be hoping they ain't coming out one of these strips for eight for five six hundred dollars for the eight channel. If they do, and they guess to give you eight channels, it's over for y'all ass. You know what go happen? Focus right go go down the drain. Cause I don't know nobody that on a red line. Focus right. Never seen it. Never heard of it. Down there you can't even find a goddamn review on it. You know what I'm saying? But send it to me, focus right, and we'll get to it. You feel me? Straight up. You know what I'm saying? I will get in it, I will talk and see what it be about. But this here, I won't recommend this to nobody. You feel me? I don't give a flying fuck. I would not recommend it because if you're looking at this most likely, you're looking for eight ins and outs. You know what I'm saying? Not four. Then what you get, four. They software probably could change it in software, but you cannot change the software. It's crazy on that there. But yeah, the focus right. I eight I twenty four channel. Do what this is a four channel interface. Sound good, low noise, but the lately see on this thing is also is also good too. I ain't even a lot to you, man. No, I don't got no delays with this little motherfucker. You know what I mean? But it, it's sexy too. It's sexy. It's sexy little piece up there. But uh, yeah, man. Y'all fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? I'm finna get that carbon in this mind. It's carbon or a 16 channel uh, universal audio. You know what I'm saying? I might get a red, a red line. You know, it's focused right. Send it to me. Let me see what it be back. But I just can't buy anything. They don't got no reviews on it. Nobody got reviews on that red line. You know what I'm saying? It's too expensive. Do you know what I mean? And, man, they full of bullshit, man. I don't trust them. They done burnt me this time. Because I knew that shit. I would never got this. But good thing I did get it. Just to let me know that 
all interfaces now these days sound good. Back in the days, psh, I was looking for a Pro 2 HD. That shit costed like thirty thousand dollars, twenty thousand. You know what I'm saying? Trying to make hits just about that. You know what I'm saying? So, good thing I I'm I'm the producer, I'm the rapper, and it's my studio. You know what I'm saying? If I was making, if this was supposed to make money, I couldn't make money with this shit. Spirit, I couldn't make no money with this shit. So focus right, get with me. They ain't paying me for this review. They didn't send it to me. I bought it without my own goddamn money. So guess what? When it's fucking up and I can't get the job done, I'm let you know. Do not buy this shit. You know what I'm saying? This shit is pure trash with the ins, just, just the ins and outs. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm mad about. The ins and outs. They didn't give me what they used to, to, to. 18 ins. What well, fuck? 20 out. And I don't got it. You know what I'm saying? So I don't even know where to get 18 ends at. That's even shit. Man. I'm out, man. But stay y'all ass away from that focus, right? If you really looking for some 80 ends, 8 out, it's 4 in, 4 out. You know what I'm saying? Straight up. I'm out. Bye.